Hi everyone, it's Kate from The Fold Line. I am back this week with the edit. This is our weekly roundup of new sewing pattern releases. Before I get going, um, last week a few people mentioned that the audio was a bit horrible. I'm having slight issues because I can't hear what is wrong with the audio at the moment. So I'm going to play with it a lot this week and try and hopefully it will be fine. But if there are issues, please will you let me know and also will you let me know what you're listening on because I'm wondering if it's if it's you're listening to it on a TV, maybe it distorts it or if you're watching it on your phone. I've tested it on all the things and I can't work out what the problem is. So and I really want to fix it because there is nothing worse than really, really cruddy sound. So I just basically need your help. So if it is bad, please let me know and I will then look into buying an external microphone or whatever it is that I need to make it better. So I'm on it, I'm trying to fix it. I just need you guys to help me because I can't hear what the problem is. <clears throat> so, right, let's talk patterns because we're not here to talk audio. Um, I have got some really good ones this week and I'm gonna start with the Friday Pattern Company Saturday Skirt Set. Love this. So this was designed, which I think I kind of love the concept. It's for the Saturday night where you have nothing to wear. We've all been there where you're looking through your wardrobe. And I think this is such a great pattern. So it's another set from them, which I think was quite interesting. The Seguro set, which I'm sure many of you have bought or made or loved, um, obviously did very well. So they've done another kind of set, which I think is great because I think I love the idea that you make a two piece that you can wear together. So let's have a look at the line drawing so we can see what is going on. It's quite a nice simple pattern. This would be really good if you're a beginner. Um, right, I haven't said anything about the technical stuff. So at the moment it's a PDF only. They will bring it out in paper, but it usually takes a few months. It does take a while. Um, so if you can't live without it, this PDF at the moment. In terms of sizing, it comes in a size UK 6 to 34. So let's talk about pattern. The skirt you can see is really lovely, sort of midi length, um, really simple, elasticated waist. It's got pockets, which I am really chuffed about. And the thing that I really like is that it's flat fronted with elastic around the back, which I think is really a lot more flattering on most body shapes, um, kind of flat at the front and then you definitely and the elastic at the back means that you've basically got some breathing room it helps when you move around it'll be a lot more comfortable to wear the top is really cute so it's um almost like a kind of shirt at the top um it's got little puff sleeves and a sort of bell sleeve that comes in, into an elasticated waist the front has these long ties and they can be um, tied lots of different ways. So you can wrap them, you could just tie them at the front, which is just at the line drawing. You can do lots of different things with it so you can sort of get creative. For me, I think this would be a really great outfit for a wedding as well as, you know, you can wear this to the beach. And also because it's separate bits, you can kind of match, you can wear the top with a pair of trousers or the skirt on its own with a t-shirt. So it's quite a versatile pattern. I think it's really, really fantastic. So next up, I'm really excited about these lingerie. Um, not usually something that I get excited about, but I really like the styles of these patterns. So from the new craft house, they've got two bras and then they've got um, three pants. So I'm not going to talk about the pants, but I'll pop a link down below to them so you can go and have a look at them. There are three different types, a thong, a hipster, and a kind of bikini brief. But the, the I thought the bras were really interesting and worth mentioning. So the first one is the Ava bra. This is a soft bra, so it doesn't have an underwire. Um, it's just got really interesting details. I love the kind of cup shape. I love the kind of seam across it with the mesh. I think it's really beautiful. Um, in terms of sizing, they've got a fantastic size range. So it comes in sizes um, 28A to 42 double J. So it's a really, really amazing size range. And um, yeah, which is fab. So I love it. I just really like the seam lines particularly of this one. So the next one from them is called the Ren Bra. And this one is again, another soft one. So no underwire, which 
I'm actually, I don't know about you guys, but I've gone into the world of non-underwire and I'm not looking back. It's so much more comfortable. Um, as long as you get the kind of proper support underneath. This one I thought was really interesting. Um, I'm just gonna read you what's written um, about it. So, <clears throat> the Ren has a super smooth finish, a crossover front and an extra panel in the larger sizes for extra support. Perfect for wearing every day and so comfortable you'll forget you're even wearing a bra, which let's be honest, that's what you want from wearing a bra to not really remember that you're wearing one. So, um, again, the size range for this is a 26A to a 42 double J. Um, and I really, again, love the seam lines of this. I love the cut. Um, I think that you could make both of these into a bikini as well. Um, I don't know why I'm saying this because I'm just, as someone who doesn't make lingerie, but I feel like they're, ni they're really nice shapes. They're very tried and tested patterns. And I think, yeah, if you feel like lingerie is your thing this year, these are definitely worth having a look at because they're just really modern and fun and but not kind of wildly complicated because sometimes I look at them and I'm like too many things so <clears throat> next up we have got from um wardrobe by me the men's heavy shirt um this comes in sizes two extra small to four extra large if that makes sense so extra extra small and extra 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 large um there's a size chart so you can have a proper look really like this it's a kind of classic shirt or shacket so you wear it as a sort of almost like a coat or a kind of lightweight jacket or as a layering piece if it's cold um, so you can make it either in a sort of slightly heavier weight cotton or you can make it in like a thick wool and it would feel more like a coat so if we have a look at the line drawing so I've got a very itchy nose um, you can see from here there are pockets on the front there's quite a big collar um, classic sort of um, cuff detail with a nice little kind of double pleat. Um, it's really kind of good wardrobe piece. If you're feeling like you'd like to make a uh, men's shirt this year, this could be a really nice option. So it's there to go and have a look at. It is available, sorry, I got distracted. PDF only for this one. Um, obviously all of the things that are PDF only, copy shop is available. So if you can't be bothered that's there. So we've got two new patterns from Juliana um, Martej and I really love them so I included both of them. Right, I'm gonna get started. So PDF only for this one, um, sizing for this, it comes in a UK 6 to 20. I thought this item, um, the basic slipover, was a really great basic, it's very much on trend at the moment. This cold as i was calling it in the trend things um cold arm detail so these sort of vests are really really popular at the moment i've seen them everywhere on the high street i'm sure you have as well and i really like the style of this it's perfect for now if you need layering you want to you you know we all want an extra layer on to keep nice and warm and it's very simple as well that's what i really liked about it um, there are two different variations with this as well, I should say. So the first one is very similar to the photograph. Um, it's kind of got, got quite a deep V at the front um, with this nice sort of crossover detail. Um, the other variation is, I, I love actually, it's a really interesting shape. So you can see that it's slightly shorter um, and it, it's longer at the back and it's got this really nice kind of um, seam detail at the bottom. I think again, this, I think this style particularly, if you're slightly petite, would be um, also, and shorter actually, because you wouldn't have to change the proportions of it so much, um, would work really well. I think it's a really interesting um, idea and I haven't really seen anything like this. So the next pattern that I've got from her, again, it's a PDF only and it's available in sizes six to 20, is a really gorgeous oversized jacket and I loved the giant pockets on this, so that's why I included them. Um, so there are two variations with this. There's a cropped version and a longer version. Um, I just, yeah, those big pockets I really love. I think they're really interesting and um, they just look fab. So if I show you some of the pictures, you can get a bit more of an idea and also the line drawings. So it's a classic kind of 
shirt, um, button down the front. The buttons are quite kind of got decent spacing between them. Um, yeah, these big statement pockets, drop sleeve, um, the cuff is very simple on this. I think you can make this quite quickly. It's a nice kind of speedy sew. So I thought that might be a nice like starting your sewing in 2023. Does anyone else take six months to work out what year we're in? <laughs> and then it's almost the next year. So yeah, I was I thought this would be a really nice option. Right, so we have got up next the Pattern Scout Birch Vest. So I will say, and I, d I don't know if anyone else has noticed this, um, it's happening quite a lot at kind of over the last year where within a week or so of each other, two patterns are released, which are really, really similar. And this has been one of those scenarios. So there is the Pattern Scout Birch Vest and there's also um, a pattern by wardrobe by me. They're very similar in style. So I've just included one, but there is the wardrobe by me version as well. So if you want to look at that, it's available. So this is a PDF only. Um, it comes in sizes UK 6 to 32. And it's a classic kind of waistcoat style. It's got a really, I really like the neckline of this. This is why I picked this one over the other one. I just thought the neckline on, on it was really elegant. Um, it's got nice big straps. It's got the kind of waistcoat point detail at the front. At the back, um, it's got, oh, I hadn't really, uh, sorry, I hadn't seen that it's got seams at the back. So it's princess theme at the front and then it's panels at the back. So you can really get the fit perfect on this. Anyone who is my age and older, or well, I just this just reminds me of something that Rachel wore in Friends. It's very much that sort of 90s feel, which is very much in at the moment. Um, but I thought this would look really great with a t-shirt underneath or a long sleeve t-shirt. And again, another nice sort of layering option. Um, it would look great with loads of different things. So that is it from me. Um, I hope you've had a lovely week and you're getting back into the year and feeling like you've got your sewing plans sort of sorted. I haven't yet, but that's just, you know, I live in chaos, so that's, <laughs> that's how I roll. Um, anyway, we'll be back next week with another video. Bye. Thank you.